Sepulpa, Oklahoma. Sepulpa is a city in Creek and Tulsa counties in the U.S. state of Oklahoma. The population was 20,544 at the 2010 United States Census, compared to 19,166 at the 2000 Census. As of 2013 the estimated population was 20,836. It is the county seat of Creek County. The town was named after the area's first permanent settler, a full-blood Lower Creek Indian named Sepulpa, of the Casada tribe, from Oshie Town, Alabama. About 1850, he established a trading post near the meeting of Polecat and Rock Creeks, about 1 mile, 1.6 kilometers, southeast of present-day downtown Sepulpa. When the Atlantic and Pacific Railroad, later known as the Frisco, built a spur to this area in 1886, it was known as Sepulpa Station. The Sepulpa Post Office was chartered July 1, 1889. The town was incorporated March 31, 1898. After Oklahoma became a state, each county held an election to determine the location of the county seat. Sepulpa competed with Bristow for county seat off Creek County. After five years of contested elections and court suits, the question was settled by the Oklahoma Supreme Court on August 1, 1913. Sepulpa was ruled the winner. The county courthouse was completed in 1914, replacing an earlier structure built in 1902. The area around Sepulpa mainly produced walnuts when the town was founded. In 1898, the Sepulpa Pressed Brick was established, followed in a few years by the Sepulpa Brick Company. This began the clay products industry. The Frisco built a rail yard in Sepulpa and by 1900 designated Sepulpa as the location of an overhaul base for its rolling stock. The founding of Premium Glass Company in 1912 marked Sepulpa's entry to glass manufacturing. Premium Glass was absorbed into Liberty Glass Company in 1918. Other glass producers in the city were Bartlett Collins Glass Company, Schramm Glass Company, and Sunflower Glass Company. According to the Encyclopedia of Oklahoma History, Sepulpa became known as the Crystal City of the Southwest. Sepulpa is also the home of Francoma Pottery. Sepulpa is located in the northeast corner of Creek County at 36.003536 minus 96.104822. A small portion of the city extends north into Tulsa County and was annexed into the city in 2004. Downtown Tulsa is to the northeast via Interstate 44. The Creek Turnpike, State Highway 364, branches east from I-44 in northeastern Sepulpa and provides a southern and eastern bypass of Tulsa. In January 2018, the Sepulpa City Council voted to approve the annexation of approximately 300 acres of land in West Tulsa. The land is bordered to the north by 51st Street, to the south by Southwest Boulevard, and to the west by 65th West Avenue. Originally, this annexation included the future site of the interchange of the Gilcrease Expressway and I-44. However, the city has now planned to annex this area back to the city of Tulsa. According to the United States Census Bureau, the city of Sepulpa has a total area of, of which is land and, or 3.21 percent, is water. As of the 2010 census, there were 20,544 people, 8,015 households, and 5,497 families residing in the city. The population density was 844.3 people per square mile. There were 8,903 housing units at an average density of 435.4 per square mile, 168.2 per square kilometer. The racial makeup of the city was 77.5% white, 3.0% African American, 10.9% Native American, 0.6% Asian, 0.2% Pacific Islander, 1.5% from other races, and 6.3% from two or more races. Hispanic or Latino of any race were 4.1% of the population. There were 7,430 households out of which 32.5% had children under the age of 18 living with him, 54.8% were married couples living together, 12.9% had a female householder with no husband present, and 27.9% were non-families. 24.2% of all households were made up of individuals and 10.5% had someone living alone who was 65 years of age or older. The average household size was 2.54 and the average family size was 3.00. In the city, the population was spread out with 26.1% under the age of 18, 7.9% from 18 to 24, 27.5% from 25 to 44. 
23.7% from 45 to 64, and 14.8% who were 65 years of age or older. The median age was 37 years. For every 100 females, there were 91.2 males. For every 100 females age 18 and over, there were 86.9 males. The median income for a household in the city was $40,372 and the median income for a family was $52,639. Males had a median income of $30,524 versus $21,609 for females. The per capita income for the city was $22,275. About 11.5% of families and 16.3% of the population were below the poverty line including 15.2% of those under age 18 and 17.4% of those age 65 or over. In 2013, the Sepulpa Creek Community Center graduated a class of 14 from its Muscogee Creek language class. The Sepulpa Daily Herald gained national media attention in early November 2008 for not reporting the election of Barack Obama as president, reporting only that John McCain had won among the voters of Creek County. Critics charged that the omission related to racism as Obama's victory as the first African-American elected president was an historic event. The newspaper maintains that it only covers local news events. The newspaper had covered every single presidential victory prior to the Obama victory. Thanks for watching. Don't forget like the video and don't forget to subscribe.